Hello beautiful people and welcome to another video with your girl Siobhan. Thank you so much for joining me for another cleaning motivational video. Guys, I think you're really going to enjoy this video. I thoroughly cleaned the kitchen. I also went through some of the cabinets, my under sink cabinet. I cleaned and organized that. Yes. Now look at this mess right here. And it is going to be transformed. I also cleaned out another cabinet to the left of that. And you'll see that. Eventually, I am going to touch up the cabinets a little bit with some paint. That's not going to be in this video. But I'm just thinking about it right now. And yeah, so I thoroughly cleaned the kitchen. I feel really good. It, looks, it still looks amazing. So yay for that. <laughs> And yeah, I'm just super excited to have you guys here. Hope you all had an amazing weekend. You know I love you so much to the moon and back. If you are new to the channel, I really hope you will subscribe and become a part of the Lifetime Loyal family. And if you are Lifetime Loyal, I love you guys to the moon and back. And stay tuned to the end. I'm going to announce a giveaway for you for the 80K. Yay! Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Also, guys, I am running a giveaway on my Instagram page as well. So if you want to join in both the giveaways, you know, just do the one here and then also follow me on Instagram and get all the deets over there and try to win that one as well. Let's hop right into the video. All right. So I knew that I wanted to organize and get rid of a few things in the kitchen. I also have a couple more drawers that I want to organize. I didn't do it in this video. I'm also going to go through the cabinets because I was just, I was getting a little tired. I, I was doing it for a couple hours. <laughs> so anyway, I knew that I wanted to do some organizing. The first thing I had to do, of course, was clean up. I just can't jump right into the organizing without cleaning up. So I love to just start with the dishes and kind of work my way around. I did the dishes and then you know how you move to the stove and so forth. I love washing the dishes. I didn't put anything in the dishwasher today. I just cleaned everything by hand. I dried it. I put it away. So that, I don't know, just is very, like I said, it's very therapeutic for me. Let me know down in the comments if that is for, you know, the same for you as well. But like I said, I had to clean up everything first and then kind of move on from there.
wrong with me? Don't know what the is wrong with me. I'm pumping up the volume to 90 degrees. Dance until it's on, till I drop to my knees. Don't know what the is wrong with me. Don't know what the is wrong with me. But I know you got that something here. I'm just a can we just talk about the lighting over here, guys? The lighting on this side is so much better. I was like, oh my gosh. Something just said, you know what, change the camera angle. And I love it on this side. So I don't know, this might be my new side for doing dishes. I love how close up it is. I just, I'm just loving it. I'm loving it. So yeah, as I'm, <laughs> as I'm watching this replay, I know you guys love to see me wash the dishes and stuff. So I was like, this is perfect. The lighting is perfect for them and they'll get, you know, a lot of motivation right here, guys. Get up, get your house together. I know y'all saw, or if you don't know, guys, I do have a vlog channel, Siobhan Melanie Vlogs. And the kids did an amazing Mother's Day vlog. I edited it, of course. But definitely go check that out. We also did eating out and shopping for Mother's Day, which was super, super fun, guys. I gave the kids some money and let them just kind of go through Walmart and pick what they want. And Ayana and London and Chris watched over the twins. And I went and shopped for my mother, my grandmother and just picked up a few things for the house. So we kind of combined the vlogs together. But again, super fun video, guys. You're going to love that. So again, go check out the vlog channel, Siobhan Melanie Vlogs. As I was going through and putting the dishes up, I noticed in the cabinets that I have a few things that I do need to get rid of. I'm starting to collect mugs and not necessarily that I want to get rid of them, that it's just that I only have really three cabinets at the top. So I wanna use that space as efficiently as possible. So I just need to pare down, possibly put some away. And you know, we, we can't use all of them. Plus I buy paper cups anyway. So I was looking, I'm like, okay, I need to get get rid of or put some of these away <laughs> until we until we move. But yeah, so I think I do very good with the amount of space that I have in the kitchen. 
I, I really do. I think I do really good with keeping everything together for, like I said, the amount of space. Let me know down in the comments what you think. I'm going to go through the cabinets in another video, like I said, because I still have a couple cabinets that I want to go through. The concrete I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way Nothing can ruin my day No matter what anyone does or say I smile at fools No, I don't care cause I am on my way Up and I won't stop I won't slow down Steady on my feet I'm gonna rise Up, no I won't stop It is my time what it's like to be broke I know what it's like when nothing goes your way so I'm gonna let myself enjoy the fruit from this lucky day yeah I am on my way up I won't slow down yeah I am on my way up I won't slow down I'm strolling down the street with all of my favorite songs on repeat. I'm dancing through. Everything's about to come my way. And I don't care if you spill coffee on me or if the sky is gray or blue. No, I don't care because I am on my way up and I won't stop. I won't slow down. Standing on my feet, I'm gonna rise up. No, I won't stop. It is my time. It's like to be broke, yeah And I know what it's like when nothing goes your way So I'm gonna let myself enjoy The fruit from this lucky day Yeah, I am on my way up I won't slow down <laughs> Yeah, I am on my way up I won't slow down Two ups. 
So this pan was giving me a little bit of trouble. I eventually put some baking soda and a little bit of water and then I used the Dawn Power Wash on it. I bought up a piece of aluminum foil and scrubbed it down really good and I think that took care of it. I don't know, it was just, it was giving me some trouble with the eggs. This is the pan that Ayana used the eggs on. This pan used to be nonstick. It is no longer that way. So I am thinking that eventually I'm going to put that in the donation bin with the other stuff that I have for the kitchen and you know as I'm going through the house and give that away and get me another nonstick pan. Nonstick pans are the best guys. I'm just I'm sorry they just save your life. They really really truly do. So even though I like the pan it you know it does the job but still I don't have time to be scrubbing for 14 bazillion hours. <laughs> I just don't want to do it. So I think I'm going to give that one away and get me another one. And yeah, I'm just thinking about going through and just getting rid of a lot of stuff that I'm not using, that I don't need, that um, does not serve a purpose for me right now. And I know a lot of you commented, thank you again, it was super sweet. They were like, don't get rid of the stuff just because you haven't used it. Um, you may still use it. You'll have a bigger kitchen when you move and so forth. And that is true. I'll have a a bigger kitchen not too much bigger i will say guys the kitchen is not big in the house the house is big it has six bedrooms two baths um but it doesn't have a big kitchen unless i decide to buy something else you never know but it doesn't have a big kitchen i would love to have one of those big kitchens that has a nice island and things like that but since i live in the city and i'm a true like it's truly in the city i don't live in a suburb it's not one of those you know big houses out in the suburbs with a lot of land and so forth it just really isn't so it's not going to it's just not going to look like that but anyway i was just thinking about getting rid of stuff so now we're moving on to the cabinet and guys <laughs> i have so many cleaning products i have so many i did purge some of them things that i've tried and it just doesn't i don't like the way they work they don't do it for me so i did get rid of some of them and actually um the two containers that i got from home goods actually used both of those and yeah so You'll see how I put everything together. I really like the way it looks. It's nice and organized. Everything can be found. I had like two um, oven cleaners and multiple, what is it? Um, multiple, oh, I can't even remember. But I, I had multiples of multiples, guys. Ammonia, yeah, ammonia. Because what I do in the summertime is I pour a little bit of ammonia in the garbage bags before we take them out because we have raccoons. And even though I bought a lid, I bought the garbage cans with lids on them. Some, it just, I don't know, it just doesn't work. So I haven't been able to remedy that situation. Um, anyway, so I'm going through, I'm getting rid of stuff that I no longer need. I'm cleaning out these baskets and these baskets come in handy. I got these baskets from home. Nope. I got these baskets from Dollar General for $6 a piece. Super duper sturdy, heavy duty baskets. I love them. They do, they serve their purpose. So I pared down, I'm only using one basket and you'll see how I organize everything, but I really like the way that it looks. Be no limit. 
away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I want to be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain wants you. I've been hanging by myself, asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. Yeah. Maybe a break, boy, you're my weakness. Giving we take the love that we make. It's my favorite drug. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain holds you. I've been hanging by myself, asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. So I'll come back and show you the finished product of the cabinet, don't worry. But right now I'm cleaning out this other cabinet right here. And this is where I keep a lot of my like serving trays and stuff. So 2019, I had a super huge breakfast for the family for Christmas. And we had, I vlogged it, but we had eggs, bacon, um, I think we had sausage, we had uh fruit all these different types of fruit and so forth but I have a lot of serving trays now a lot of these I got on clearance those blue ones that I was showing you those were actually the kids won those in a contest at church a singing contest they had won those and just I'm just going through and some of them I got from the Goodwill and such so I'm going through these and deciding what I'm keeping and what I'm not and as you can see I did keep a a few of them and then I'm getting rid of these plates and stuff right here that I no longer need but as you can see it's pretty clean in there pretty organized the best that I can do for now and then these are the plates and stuff that I'm getting rid of um, yeah I no longer I no longer need those these blue ones they won and then these ones right here I think I got from like the dollar store so not really or 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 goodwill I can't remember but anyway I'm using my steamer now to clean the garbage yes my garbage tends to get whoo it, it, it goes to another level another planet I don't know it just it just goes so I try to wipe it off I did spray it with Dawn power wash I let that sit for a minute then I steamed it and then I'm also going to spray some of my disinfectant on it and wipe it off again so it's nice and clean <laughs> nice and clean you'll see the lid fell in the garbage I put it back on and went and washed my hands before I touched the steamer again I was like really oh my gosh then it fell in there again and I did the same thing I think I cut that part out but anyway I'm getting it all nice and clean if you don't have a steamer definitely get you one I got that steamer from Walmart I think it was $30 something like that I ordered it online they sent it to the house in like two days guys um, I know Aldi had one at one point that was like $15, $20. I missed that deal. But yeah, they have them everywhere. Definitely check it out. But they come in handy. Definitely come in handy. I love the steamer.
you close, but you know my mind is torn up. I never thought it'd be like this. You think that I should calm down And that I'm overthinking everything about you And that we're good the way we are mm -hmm. But I don't know that much Thank you all so much for watching the video. I really, truly hope you enjoyed it. I hope you can see how clean and organized and tidy everything is looking. I feel really good. I feel like I did a really, really good job. And like I said, I am going to go through the cabinets up top and just clean those out, purge some things that I no longer need. And then also I do have one little cabinet over here that I am going to clean out. But for the most part, I love my kitchen. It is very functional. Yes, it is small, but it does serve its purpose and I enjoy it. So as you can see, I do keep all of my towels and rags and then under the kitchen sink is nice and tidy. Very pleased with it. It looks good to me. It functions. I just love it. I do. And then also the other cabinet is nice and clean and organized as well. And yes, I am going to wipe off the cabinets and then touch them up with a little bit of paint. But thank you all so much for watching. I love you guys to the moon and back. Hope you have an amazing day and we'll talk later. Bye. Okay, beautiful people. All you have to do to be entered into the giveaway is comment down below giveaway subscribe to my channel and also subscribe to my vlog channel Siobhan Melanie TV. All right, you got this. Bye.